Yo! Video games. I am the guy where I will have many women in my bed. You know they replaced Kratos' voice actor in the new one? Well, we were talking about that when you were gone. Um, what was it? The TJ... Uh, TC Carson. TC Carson was uh, yeah. the voice, and he was in Living Single. And I was like, what? Yeah. I remember that guy. I was like, he oh, was shit. pretty salty about replacing him. Really? Yeah. He was not happy about that, no. huh? My whole... Th my whole thing yeah, was this. the voice of a character in an iconic... <laughs> Sorry, dudes! Hey! 542. I'm sorry, dudes. Here's my thing about, about TC Cars getting replaced. If they were gonna say, oh yeah, well we wanted to go with a different direction with Kratos' voice, why did you get someone who just sounded exactly the fucking... Like, I like him. Like, to do it, yeah, yeah, So yeah. you just hired someone else to do the same fucking voice. <laughs> Uh, maybe he was a problem to work with, or maybe they didn't want to pay him enough money. Maybe. Who knows? Yeah. I mean, those are the two factors that I'm thinking on. Like, yeah. Maybe he's a diva, or he he or he was his um, agent was uh, negotiating too much money for him. I, I guess. I was so, like, I don't know, man. It's which kinda, makes sense. I was like, well, Tony, why are you going to sit there and say, oh, we wanted to go a new direction with Kratos? What? We had a new voice actor, I'm like, so you got someone who sounded just, just like exactly him. Exactly like him. No, it's not a new direction, you sorry liars. <laughs> like, what the fuck? <laughs> what? Steve getting the work right to the point. Yeah, man. You sorry liars. Yeah, it's pretty it's pretty it's pretty rough. But you know what? Um the original actor of um of uh, Dark Vader was pretty pissed off when he found Dr. out Domes. Uh, when he found out that he, his voice was replaced. Um, yeah, but if you if you've heard fucking David Prowse's voice. Yeah, I can You <laughs> need to talk to Ford the Princess! Yeah, I can. Come on! Where are you where are you hiding the plan? Yeah, I can understand. This is the counselor shop where I'm at. I'm almost like Rick Moran. At one side I can I understand did. why they replaced him, and one side I can understand why he'd be pissed off about it. Sounded like Rick Moran. Should have just been up front with him, like, dude, yeah. Yeah, we're gonna change your voice or something like that. Instead of just sneakily doing it and just putting it in the thing, and then he finds out at like the day of, you know? It's like, what the fuck? Kind of a slap. Enough Kratos. With every city you destroy. Voice actor strike might have played a factor too. Wow, there was a voice actor strike at that time. Oh, yeah. God. Yeah, it only ended a little while ago. Yeah. Oh shit, it's been going on for like it went on for like a year or two. Do not Damn. forget that it was I who made you a god, ghost of Sparta. Do not turn your back on me. I owe you to the flames of the discord. Then you leave me no choice. Kratos had turned the pain of his memories into hatred. Hatred for the gods. He had refused to free him from the nightmares of his past deeds. And so he went to Rhodes to deliver He's British. the final blow yes. to the besieged. I want them alive! He sounds like Rick Moranis to a team. I think maybe that's the joke. Maybe he heard the original. Oh, voice. he's all huge. That's cool. Yeah, right, right. Yeah, because he had the power of the gods. Yeah, he's God Man. He's using God Boat. Yeah. And then. Fucking birds! Because he had the power of Ares, I believe, after this. This part was sick, man. I always, I really love this part. Suit me. I was creating you! Well, the ending was like he became the god of war. Oh, god. Yeah. He kills Ares at the end, but then he did. Simmons, please! What? He's gonna replace it. I haven't beat him. God of War? Yeah. Well, oops, you're watching him be the god of war right now. Yeah, I know. So, yeah, that's what's going on. So, at the end, when Nathan Drake dies. Max, come on! Spoilers. Yeah, he never wanted to be the god of war. Athena, you will stop. And so will these guys. Well, I think in this boat he has like everything. He has like all his boats. I think. I could be wrong. Oh, there she is. Oh, fuck. Oh, that's true. Remember this game looking amazing for the PS2, man. Fuck yeah, well, they, they, they use every square inch of the place. This was like one of those games like Devil May Cry 3 where I'm like, man, video games can't look any better. Yeah. It's just impossible. Especially this, where they have that giant titan in the background. Yeah. Yeah. Oh it's like, why do we need a PS3? This game doesn't can't look any better. Yeah. And then HD TVs came out, and yeah. all your old games looked worse. <laughs> and it ruined like, everything. Oh. And it ruined everything. L1 plus face one. Nice. Yeah. yeah, air combos, man. I used to go in on this game. Yeah, and you can do a spinny fucking thing in the air. Yeah, you gotta launch him and then uh, uh, jump up. Let's yeah. fucking don't make cry. Literally, never fucking make cry. But you gotta figure out what the launcher is. Oh, triangle. 
There you go. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, you, you can go in. He still has some of the powers of a god. This is the level on uh, MK, uh, MK9, actually. Yeah. Which is tournament banned, hilariously enough. Is it really? Yeah, it uh, it has too many screen shakes. Oh, there's so a guy like in a, the background? Uh, you no, know, the level itself. Like, whenever the uh, statues in the background start moving, it causes the screen to shake and it's disrupted. I don't think I've ever seen that stage. Really? Holy shit. On MK9, yeah, it was tournament banned. It's, it's little, actually it one of the most. Black. It's actually one of the most legit uh, stages. stages in the game because it has like a pit fatality with three different options. Really? Yep. You can put him in the pit, and if you put triangle, you get one death. Neil, you're all fucking yeah. with me. He got us. Yeah, he got us. Make it cool. Damn. He is able. Shit. Take that guy. You're right. Like that guy had no chance. It's from God of War Three. God of War 3. Oh, it's a stage from God of War 3? Okay. So, God of War 3 pretty much had the same stage as this one. I'm just shocked of all the times we've played Mortal Kombat 9, I've still never seen that stage. Yeah, I'm actually really uh, surprised. Dude, we need to... We tried to avoid it, though. Uh, I didn't try to avoid it, we just never picked the stage. It's random. This, I just love, this was like one of my favorite fights. Because I always thought that was amazing, like, the giant uh, titan statue coming to life. Pretty dope. Yeah. I want to compare this one with Gears of War. Gears of War and God, the only thing those two have in common is their, is their, uh... Band and of War. Yeah, G-O-W. That's the only thing they really have in common. I wouldn't compare this to Gears of War at all. I remember too, because like I always wanted to see the Titan statues. Oh, he said, "Fuck that shit." <laughs> He's mad. Close up of Kratos' grimace face. Yeah, right. He did that resting bitch face again. He's like, "Hmm, right." Okay with this. I just launched myself. <laughs> this is Sea of Thieves, guys. Sea of Thieves. Damn! That was a bad idea. <laughs> Holy crap! Wait, is that Athena controlling him? Yeah. He also yells. Is that as intimidating? Wow, he's going through. Yeah, there's people up there, so he's just grabbing him and throwing him at him. Man, that's so fucking cool. Yeah. Jump on his arm! Uh, oh, they can jump on his arm. Oh, now we'll listen to yourself. Uh, maybe. I don't know why I'm getting a, uh, a, an Ico a Shadow of the Colossus vibe. It's a big thing. Yep. Oh, yeah, yeah, his arm. Yeah, you just have to hit it. For some, for some reason, the statue is not intimidating at all, especially when he yells. He yells Ooh, at me. Did you see the Hydra? That is intimidating. This guy's like, ah. Uh. <laughs> Maybe he needs sharp teeth. Because he needs spikes, Steve. He needs spikes! That's what he needs! Not intimidating without spikes. Now I think he can do it. He's like stunned. Hmm, I wonder what you should be doing now. Hmm. Always go for the eyes! Oh. Dang, you got like all like rainy from there. Alright. Here comes the water part. That's uh that is a huge jump in pacing. Yeah. Yeah, which is sad. Yeah. You go for like this epic battle, this crazy thing. It's, it's like the, the we had that happen in the first one where it was like fighting a giant hydra and then swimming. Yeah. Yeah. Like Facing as this huge spike and then a huge down spike. Yeah. It's like, whoa. Uh, what is that? Resident Evil uh, 6. 
where you get, everything is like really fucking cool, and then you go into like the the, the cave. There could be a moon then, coming up next. Darn it. Why are you? He misses the boob. Okay, so he, Simmons missed the boobs. Whatever you yeah. do, avoid it, Simmons. Yeah. You've seen him one, you've seen them all. I've seen at least three boobs in my life. Yeah. And they're all pretty much the same, right? They're bronies? Yeah. yeah. You? What? Continue. Okay. Dr. Blazes, happy. Thank you for the tier two, man. Kind of a shame. Wait, wait, hold on a second. Let me, uh, let me just, uh, Where what is... Yeah, open that thing up, Simmons. What's that? There's nothing in there. Oh! oh! Cooch oh! and Teet! Oh, oh my god! Damn it, they are perfectly symmetric. Oh, Look at that frontal? shit! Those are some stripper titties. All right, that's like right. Oh! 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 Simmons. Oh yeah. my god! Did they have penetration? Like, yeah! Did they have, like, full uh, penetration? What is this? Plastic surgery in this fucking times? What is going on? Oh They're, my god, keep going. Perfect! Oh. faster! Oh. Wow! wow. I, I can't oh. believe they showed full penetration oh. on PS2! Oh my god! Oh. Holy shit! Oh. The only way- In oh. between the cooch and the oh. 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 oh my Jesus. god! He let it happen! Oh man! The quick release, man. Uh, got Gyro, all your health Did back. you see it? Gyro, did you see it? What's behind door number two? Nah, no, no, I will. Thank you. It's really disappointing in that area. All right, so it's time to Pretty leave. Pretty sure that was it. Time to leave. Are you afraid of boobies, Max? Dude, chat, you missed it, man. Do it on your, chat, do it on your stream. Was, okay. It was amazing. You think I won't? I need a cigarette. I need oh. a cigarette. Well, this fucking shit. And the mods can see everything. Yeah, if but you're a mod awesome. chat, you get to see it. Yeah. That's how it works. If you're a mod, you get to see it. <laughs> oh, that didn't work out very well, Simmons. <laughs> oh, yeah. There you go. Oh, this, oh Jesus. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> wow, that is quite a quick web swing. I like his double jump. There's like, it, there's, there's no uh, like really good. Look at that. <laughs> there's no good animation. He just jumps. Show no mercy. Okay. Show no mercy to the, to the semi, to the demigod. Oh, looks like you guys showed no mercy. Good job. Great plan, Captain. God. Foot. God. That was cool. Unexpected as fuck. I totally don't remember that at all. I mean, as epic as all this shit is, it's nowhere near as epic as Asura's Wrath. Yeah. 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 Like, that shit is bonkers. Asura's Wrath, as we all described when it was coming out, was just Japanese God of War. Yeah. And it's pretty much Japanese God of War with not as good gameplay, uh, but tease. way better, like, visuals and cinematics. Yeah. Well, well God of War 3. God of War 3 is comparable, absolutely. Like, what about, visual wise, like, goddamn. What yeah. about, um, uh, God Hand? Uh, God Hand's a PS2 game. God Hand's a PS2 game. Yeah. God does, God, does God not have great visuals. Yeah, God Hand is just Fist of Snowman. Star. No, he does not. Yeah, God of War 3 is pretty nuts, though, but in terms of, like, crazy shit, Slay Waffler, thank you, dude. They go over the top. You yeah, that hurt the Swiss Rap. There you go. Oh, you have to let you his hand, I think. And dodge first. Ooh! Is that a catapult? I am the god of war! Oh, fuck ah! him up! I am the god of the him up. Again. Uh, Triple Brim Doc, thank you. How many do you have? I will make you suffer. I think you need to go fuck about that one. 
Uh, eat my ass and taste my gas. Oh God, Max, what? That's what he said. Jeez. There's a lot of health. Maybe you can find a box or something. None shall defy me. I will make you suffer. Are you hurt? There you go. Are right, you gonna run all the way over there? Off. Fuck. All the way over there. Is there your health box? Maybe you can pick up. I don't think it was hard enough. Yeah, rolling has a huge amount of recovery. Uh, <laughs> nice! Damn, fucked him up. Ow, my face! My face! Oh my god. Oh, you got some health back. Nice. I will make you suffer. Suffer. Damn, even randomly activated. Yeah, it, it's, it. if you want to talk about power levels, like Asura goes beyond fucking Superman. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. Like, Asura is, is a god. Like, he grows the size of a planet and takes on the universe, like, type of shit. Doesn't Bayonetta's hair kind of do that too? Nothing to that extreme. Nothing extreme. Like, Asura, as a regular sized guy, fights a dude the size of a planet. And fights him as a regular sized guy. Oh. Yeah. Like, I don't, I, if you want to talk about some fucking power level shit, I don't know, man. You gotta you got convince me. You gotta fucking. <laughs> some serious convincing beyond the Sura. You gotta get you gotta, me you gotta of, sit on that table with a little cup of coffee. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. The Sura's pee comes from the balls. <laughs> oh, God. Shit. That remind me of that, uh, what was it? Uh, Green Lantern uh, episode. The dude was trying to fight, like, the best Green Lantern, and he ended up on a planet, and he was trying to fight him, and he eventually, like, left all. Or he died or something like that on the planet. And then the Green Lantern turned out to be the actual planet. Mogo. Mogo? Mogo. Mogo. Mogo is uh, the sentient planet. Yeah, I was like, that's kind of cool. I thought he was gonna turn to the right and see some tits. He's gonna be like, yeah. there they are. Alright, boobs. Eight out of ten. Boobs. They're behind oh, this man. door. Yes! <laughs> Max is getting ready. Ha! There they are. Oh. That's some, you know, that was, a, I think that was a kind of a little misstep of this game. Boobs? Like, no, the very first part, like, having this big battle. All these then, big battles, like, always are. Giant spikes! Yeah, yeah. Hard and spikes so all the way down. Yeah. Insane action! Nothing! I remember yeah, like, when I was like playing this when it first came out, man, this is cool, and it's not so cool. And this is not so cool. Well, it can't be like, you know, insane all the time. But it's gotta have like a drop. Yeah. Like, it's, like, it's gotta be like spike and then a drop. And then it, this would be, it should go in waves well, yeah. and not like earthquakes. How was, how was the arc in Asher's Wrath? Was it like, was there any drop? No, Asher's Wrath is not a good video game. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. No, it's got some awesome moments, but it could practically be a fucking movie. Right, right. Yeah. yeah. It is not a good video game. It's, it's a got QTE. It's got crap controls and a lot of QTEs. Yeah, but QTEs. In terms of those moments and QTEs, they're like the fucking sickest shit. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but let's let's be honest, the game is a solid 6 out of 10. Ouch. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, really? It is without a doubt. But in my yeah. personal book, the game's like a 9 because it's so fucking cool, yeah, dude. Yeah. You were having so much fun with the game. I love it. I mean, that's why I give it like a nine out of ten. It's got Jesus, man. It, it it's one of the best original Capcom characters ever. It's got and it actually has a good story and great characters. Yeah. It's got bad guys you love to fuck up. Dude. <laughs> oh my god. It's a great. It's mostly an interactive movie. It's an anime. Yeah. There you go, Alan. See, Alan disagrees, but like, it's an anime. I'm fighting a big. Giant statue. Now let me go move this. And do some puzzles yeah. and do that. Yeah. Ah, oh, interesting. Got it. Got to it. It's like their gameplay variety was interesting to say the least. Oh, nice. almost, you've almost made that without even doing the puzzle. Ah. Well, this is way more fun, right, Chad? People like puzzles. It is a video game. Yeah, but like, just do it after you fight that fucking thing. 
it's like it's like in a well, movie. He's, he's in well, here's the thing: like, man, like in a movie, some movies have a big action sequence in the beginning to catch you, yeah, yeah. and then the movie kind of slows down. Yeah. They don't have a big action sequence, and then it stops for a few minutes, and it goes to a slow part, and then the action sequence continues. Yeah, yeah. They, they get the big action sequence that gets you hyped up, and then you go through it. This is like action sequence. Die with honor. Movie slow down. Uh, Naito Curry, thank you. We're gonna get back. Like, an example would be, like, that guy throws you the hell away, and then you start fighting all these guys immediately, yeah. and then the guy starts stomping and shit, but yeah. slowly you escape Slip, him. Yeah. yeah. And then, and then you do some puzzles, and then he comes back. Like, that's, that's a curve, you know right, what I mean? Right. Instead of, like, fighting giant dude, tossed away box puzzles. It's extreme highs that go directly to an extreme low. Exactly. Yeah, that's, that's what I mean. Exactly. It's a spike. Yeah, it's like yeah. a heart spike, amazing, heart spike low. Okay, we're doing yeah. some of those. Man, that, uh, especially food, it tastes a little well as well. Like, it's always crazy to some extent. This is odd pacing. Yeah. Well, like, well it's, 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 it's mid-2000s action game pacing, where they're like, well, we have to make our game you gotta have these other elements, you can't just be pressing square, 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 square all the time. time. Right, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. I do not I don't really think Devil May Cry did that much either. It's like they, they add the talents on their pacing. Yeah, except for maybe part two. Part two. Yeah, DM, DMC games focus on the combat a lot and always try to reward you with new shit a lot. Right, so has got off. Four had, yeah, four is a. I love four. Four is a bad game with amazing mechanics. <laughs> yeah. Defeated the Titans. Drain your godly That's sword? into the sword, Kratos. Whose sword is that? Only then will you reach your full potential. Why do you aid me now? What Deadpool I babe is your last chance, man. For the good of Sick of it, dude. Olympus. Sick of seeing you ask questions with a billion different things. Just uh -oh. enjoy the stream, man. Word of God. Uh oh. Appreciate you know what I want to know, but just enjoy the stream. We're watching you. What is that like, uh, Max One One Six O's like brother over there or something? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, everything. Everything has a question. Uh -oh. Ledge climb. Climb the ledge. That is this sort, right? Okay. And the bow and arrow guys are the uh, worst. They're the ones that will actually uh, uh, deal if a lot of damage. You hold down Y, you do a launcher, and you can like press jump after, and you get a big slow mo thing. Yeah, yeah, he was doing that before. Yeah, dude. I mean, DMC Four has some of the best mechanics in a in an action game ever. However, the game around it kind of fucking sucks. Uh, like the levels, the level design in that game is horrible. The uh, and the fact that you backtracked that horrible level design a second time! We're best, best friends, friends play. play! I guarantee you that's Dark Lashard, yep. Uh, uh, was it? Uh, yeah, yeah, it absolutely yeah. was. No, Max, no! They, they sub. Come on, Max. They sub, yeah. yeah they sub. Yeah. Well, it was after yesterday, Matt McMuscle was so happy. That's true. How good we made it, right? how authentic he was. And, and how much he enjoyed us playing the game, and, and yeah. he, he appreciated us, uh, you know, Enjoying the game as much as we did. Yeah, as we did. Sure, and he was like, man, like he actually DM'd me. He's like, Kenny, that was amazing. How close? Yeah, you know, yeah. Like, he hit me up on Twitter. and was like, dude, you guys. I, I remember you guys doing the screen shakes and shit. Remember that part? And I was like, yeah, it was really good. And he was like, yeah, it was awesome. I'm like, thank you for showing me that game, man. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, though, Max, I think even Devil May Cry 3 suffers from that problem, too. Well, I was, I was just about to mention that. Not nearly as hard. Like, I guess it's like not as a bad, fourth yeah. as bad. Like, it's... But, uh, but, it, but 3 has, like, a giant thing where the tower oh, changes and you have yeah. to revisit the tower again. Yeah, yeah. But the enemies are just slightly different. I'm like, this is kind of lazy. Yeah. Chad, which, which, um... Which, uh, God of War, where, where he goes to the river sticks? That's three. Three, okay, yeah, yeah, that, that, one. One. God, that yeah, one. Yeah, God of War 3 has an amazing intro. Dude, when he That's goes, one, six, when he goes down to, like, the, um... To hell. To hell, and then, like, you hear, uh, the, the dude talking. It's awesome. Like, I used to play it with, like, a good system. And he goes. And he goes. It was awesome. Three. Like, if you've ever listened to that one... Wait. If we actually want to be truly, truly honest, 
from a completely unbiased perspective. Blixer, yes, sir. thank you. The the Devil May Cry game with the best level design is DMC. One. No, no, don't don't take game. Don't take. Game. Well, that's some cool shit aspects to it. Like you're going. It does. The levels. It really does. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Starts changing and getting crazy in the middle of it. It's oh. got some fun traversal yeah. elements Juicy with the hook. And, look. I mean, I, 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 for this is from a completely unbiased perspective and a guy that does not like Dante as a character at all, uh, I do feel that gameplay design-wise, and of all the Devil May Cry games, the next closest is one, easily. Uh, Moten's ball suit, thank you. Yeah, I like God. one, one's design. Well, I like the idea of just that being on that one island, the creepy island. Yeah, it's great. The castle and the it's like a Resident yeah, Evil castle. It's, it's yeah. cool. If you haven't forgotten, we're fighting a massive titan. the same part. Are you full? Agreed. Yeah, agreed. Because you want to come back here. 